Hey guys, what's up? I am eight days now without chewing tobacco. Um, feels great. Um, it's been one of the hardest things I've ever had to do. Um, I'm just now getting out of work, so I do crave it. I didn't crave it over the weekend. No, I did crave it over the weekend because I didn't have anything to do. Yesterday was Sunday. This is my week without it. And I actually didn't have a major craving at all all day. I mean, I thought about dip because that just kind of sits in your mind when you're bored, but I haven't had, I didn't have like a huge craving for it yesterday, so that's exciting. Um, today I'm getting out of work. Yeah, I kind of crave it a little bit just because I always get a dip, you know. I always get a dip right when I get out of work, so. But I'm, I'm really happy and proud of myself. I made it past a week, so it's a big deal. Um, I'm not gonna, not gonna give up. I'm gonna keep going. It's tough. One of the hardest things I've ever done, but I've kind of embraced it. You know, I, it sucks so bad, but at the same time, I'm just like, you know what, Trey, that's what you get. Maybe next time you won't freaking start dipping again. You know, it's kind of funny. Like, I just tell myself, like, it sucks. You know, I told you, you know, I should have started doing it. I should have started doing it during the day. And I used to just dip whenever I drank, you know. Then I knew that when the minute I started drink, uh, dipping without alcohol during the day, I just started dipping all the time. And I did. So, um, it's one of the hardest things to get off of. It's harder than alcohol. You know, I'm three weeks off, over three weeks now off of alcohol. It's nothing compared to trying to get off dip. Smoking, I smoked for two and a half years, and I've dipped now for two and a half years. Smoking was nowhere near this hard to quit. So, uh, it's tough. I'm not gonna lie. Um, do I notice anything different? Yeah, I mean, I'm not, I don't have any more headaches. I don't get headaches a lot whenever I dip, so the headaches are starting, you know, I don't get headaches anymore. Um, my appetite's higher. Trying to ease that up now. It was bad for the first week. Now it's starting to kind of subside a little bit, thankfully, because I didn't want to gain like 15 pounds just because I quit dipping. Um, my teeth feel a heck of a lot better. That's one of the things I was going to talk about today is my teeth. Um, my teeth feel a lot better. Uh, my gums mainly, right here. It's not, I had not really... I'm not really saying that they're growing back, the gum's growing back over them yet. I, and I really don't have any crazy problems, just right here, my gums kind of receded a little bit down. So, you know, from tobacco abuse, just keeping it there. But, uh, my, my, you know, my gums aren't raw anymore or anything like that. It's like they've uh, kind of healed over, so they feel a heck of a lot better. So, hopefully that keeps going. So, if you're doing this, guys, and you're quitting, um, no, it's going to be a tough road, okay? Um, if, you, if you slip up or relapse, whatever you want to call it, kind of an inappropriate word for, I think, dip, but <laughs> whatever. Um, I mean, if, 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 you, if you slip up and you do that, then start over and, and go back at it. Don't, don't reach an all-time low and start doing it more than you've ever done just because you messed up. That's important. Um, so yeah, that's all I want to say. I'm proud of myself. I want you to be proud of yourself. I want you to rate this video. I want you to comment comment, and give me some feedback. Uh, subscribe to my channel. I'm going to keep doing these videos uh, through day 14. And then I'm just going to do one every week, probably for a few weeks, and then I'll stop on that. But I'll give you, I'm also going to give tips on how to quit to make it easier for you. I'm going to give you tips on alcohol addiction, how to quit that. Um, also, I'm going to have more advice and stuff on stress and anxiety, a disorder that used to run my life. Um, I'm starting this new series uh, coming up, kind of like a playlist deal, whatever. Uh, I'm going to start reviewing uh, supplements like health supplements and like uh, protein bars and stuff like that. Um, it'll be fun. I'm kind of getting into working out, so it'll be something, it'll be a learning experience for me and maybe you too. So, anyways, uh, I got to get out of here, guys. Y'all have a good one. Bye.